Welcome back to Nina Renee Knows. Today we are going to go over filters. Internal filters. Internal filters are not filters that the user would see or choose or select that would normally appear at the top of the report once it's previewed. But the filters we will go over today are filters that only you as the report designer can see. So the first way to make an internal filter is to right click on your data set and then click on data set properties. Click on filters and then click on add. In the expression box you want to choose which field you want to filter on. So for this example I'm going to choose holiday code date and in the operator I'm going to choose greater than and in the value, I am going to make a formula to choose dates where the date is greater than today. Press OK. And you'll see that when you preview your report, the results will be all of the holidays where the date is greater than today. And today is January 21st. So you may ask, why would you make a filter when you can just simply change your query to run for all the dates greater than today? So that's where the second type of internal filters plays a major role. Instead of adding a WHERE clause to your query, you can keep the query generic and have your filter, like I just showed you, and then you can add another tablix using the exact same data set but with a different filter. And the way you would do that is you would go ahead and add your table to the report and bring in the fields like you normally would. But this time, instead of clicking on Dataset Properties, you're going to go to Tablix Properties and add your filter to this specific Tablix. So click on Filters, click on Add, and choose the field you want to filter on. Again, we are going to use Holiday Code Date. And we're going to choose Less Than and for my value, I am going to choose the date function where the holiday code date is less than six months from today. So press OK. And when you preview this report, you will see that the first data set abides by the first filter we put in place, which is everything greater than today. And the second data set, or the second tablix, abides by the second filter we put in place, which was everything less than six months from today. And there you have it. The reason to choose data set and tablix filters over report query criteria. I'm just going to clean this up a little bit and make it a, look a little bit nicer. If this video was helpful, give it a thumbs up so that others can see it. If you have any questions, leave them down below and I will reply. And I will see you in the next video, which should be about parameters. And parameters are the filters that users actually choose from. And I will see you then.